Good morning, everybody. It is 10.30, woo, in the PM. I always gotta specify what, if it's the AM or the PM we're in. We woke up not too long ago, maybe an hour or so. Ugh. Are we leaving the house today? No, we're not leaving the house today. It's 10.30. It's later than we woke up yesterday, so we might be staying up all the way around. I don't really know how this is gonna work. But we didn't sleep all the way through. Stella kept waking me up in between because she was like, oh! I got a fish! It's time to go fishing! It's fishing time! That's with her, uh, pocket. Her animal, animal crossing on the phone game. She wakes up and there's like a turn like, oh, I gotta go fishing, I gotta go fishing. And that happens every three hours. So she'd wake up every three hours like, oh, I gotta go fishing. I didn't miss one. I only woke up once. We didn't sleep that long. Oh gosh, she's really into that game. They should sponsor us. Hint, hint. Wink, wink. What does Nintendo respond to anything? I don't know. It's a Nintendo game. Oh. One day we'll be big enough. Okay. It'll come to us. Okay. I don't know how to end these segments. I just full stop and then it gets edited. Hello! Did you want to spin? Hello! That's really close. I'm sorry. What? We have some... Gochujang? Good. They call it a hot pepper paste. I mean, I'm sure it says but you're not Korean, but in English it says hot pepper I'm gonna be making some pork country ribs, and that is how I prepare it. So yeah, she just took it out of the freezer. Oh, you can go show them. So I just like them. It's okay. You remember, we have all of our pork. This is. The rest of them are beef, one more pork, and then I have the logs of pork, which I want to try baking with, and like a pastry. So, nope, nope, that's gonna stay here. In case you're wondering what a cup of Luigi's is doing, it's full of baking soda. Since we didn't prep this yesterday, it's a big ol' frozen block right now, which is fine. Are you sure it's fine? You've never cooked it like this. I've never cooked it from frozen. Oh. I think it'll be fine, honey. Well, so what she usually does is she just braises it. For two hours. For two hours or so. So Stella was just saying how much she liked cooking with it. Uh-huh. Because all she's got to do is put it in there. It's like a formula. So I have a pound of pork country ribs, which is cut up into little chunks already in the little Ziploc bag. And then I add seasoning, and then I add water to kind of just fill it to the top. And then you're really close now. <laughs> and then maybe some vegetables like carrot, onion, and celery, depending on the flavors. But today we're going Korean, so I have some onion and some uh, shiitake. And then on the side we'll have green beans later. And some gochujang. Okay. Maybe some napa. That sounds fun. But that won't go until like the last 10 minutes of it. And let's take a quick update on our pickled mustards. That little air bubble that was trapped the other earlier was here somewhere. It's gone. That's good. You should have marked it. Well, I figured it's gonna bubble out. There's some other air bubbles here. It's okay. Um, it hasn't really changed much since it's really only been a couple of hours. Ten hours or so? I don't know. I think it's been ten hours. All right. That's it. Away. Stella's finished adding all the magic sauces and ingredients. And we're just gonna let it stew and simmer for the next couple of uh, hours. Two hours? You like the texture of the two hour mark. Yeah. I also really like this pork because it's uh, it's fatty enough that it gives it a nice so if you, rich flavor. You know how there's like dark and light chicken? I think this is dark pork. Okay. It's, it's, if, if you think of chicken, it's not as dry and it's not fattier than the white chicken. Kind of like it. Did you record me do that? When your choice factor is current word is erased and you can choose a different target. Oh, I had a problem with that earlier. This is playing a typing game. It's getting progressively harder. 
he feels he needs to learn how to type again. Yeah, I type better than Stella though. I finished it! Uh, average kill time, key accuracy, 96.1, what? Alright, so right now I'm going to take a typing test using typingtest.com. What are you doing? I'm showing them that I'm making hot chocolate. <laughs> but I'm telling them about my typing thing. Okay, go ahead. So, let's see how fast I type now. I'm going to do a one minute test. I'm going to do a couple one minute tests. Three years. Stella, what are you doing? Probably going to do like three or so uh, one minute tests. I was on the interwebs the other day and Dvorak came up. I've heard of that before. And Dvorak is a different uh, keyboard layout. So I was looking at different keyboard layouts and seeing if uh, any of them would be faster. I chose Dvorak instead of some of the other ones because it's the only other one that's going to be on all computers just to make things easier. It's, there are only like two ANSI keyboard layouts. One is the QWERTY, which everyone uses on the others. Dvorak. This type thing is where you just type and you don't, and you don't need to look at the keyboard. Oh, I forgot why I, why I changed to Dvorak. So Dvorak is supposed to be better for your hand. All right, a minute. All right, so I was wrong. We're not able to stay up till 4 p.m. today. Instead, it is 8.30 in the a.m. And we're gonna be going to sleep. Hello. But maybe we'll be sleeping less? Hopefully we'll be sleeping less. Maybe we'll wake up at 12. Maybe 1? I don't know. We're going to sleep less, wake up, and then be up for less, and then go back to sleep. I think. Are we doing this naturally or with a lot? I like to sleep naturally, but um, we should probably try and get our sleeping schedules back on track, so maybe we'll have an alarm. Oh. And then we could practice typing again. Oh, that was fun. Oh, was it really? Well, I didn't, I feel like you, what? you were annoyed and frustrated a lot more than I was. Yeah. It's so annoying when you're, when you're very, prof not, I'm not super proficient, but when you're proficient at something and then your productivity goes down 90%, that's so rough. Okay. Yeah, I'm not gonna sleep. Well, wouldn't I also have been gone down by a lot? Um, so you type 50 words per minute and then maybe you type 10 words per minute now? Okay. So that's 20%. But you're still better at me right now. And then I used to type 80 words per minute and then now I type like 15 words per minute. Okay. So now it's a bigger drop for me. So my percentage of deprovement is greater than yours. I don't think I'm at 10%. 10 words a minute now. I'm at like two. No. <laughs> yeah, and it's pretty cool that the whatever site we're using because it tells you how long you've been practicing and then uh, oh, what else does it tell you? It, it also tells you, you really bad yeah, what letters you show. hit and how often you hit it. And there's also something, it's called like a confidence meter. And I think it measures um, how quickly you hit a button after you see whatever letter to see how confident you are that that's the correct thing. It's pretty cool. But at the end of all this, we will know how long it took me to learn and how much practice it took till I got Dvorak. Learnt. 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 I'm gonna learn it. Okay. Alright. Good night. It's been fun. It's been real guys. If you like the video, hit the hit the button with a thumbs up. You let the sun win today. Yeah, subscribe. let the sun win. Yeah, subscribe. We're gonna be hopefully doing these videos very consistently. Subscribe, like, ding the bell. Boop, 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 boop.